welcome to the third episode of Ontario Camping. Today we're looking at the Golgoin Provincial Park Highway 60 corridor. Before we continue, if you like this format and like to see more videos, please like and subscribe. The Golgoin is beautiful no matter what season. We typically go camping in the summer and fall and they visit in the winter. Even in the winter you can camp in Mew Lake or simply rent a yurt. There are 15 hiking trails from easy to hard, interior camping either by canoe or hiking, a very nice visitor center, art center, mountain bike trails and many lakes and beaches. The follow campgrounds are available in Algonquin. Tea Lake, which is all non-electric, close to the lake, Canis Bay electric and non-electric site, this is typically our go-to campground. Mew Lake is also electric and non-electric with some very nice waterfront sites, Lake of Two Rivers, electric and non-electric, waterfront site, it tends to be very busy and not a lot of privacy, Pog Lake, electric and non-electric with some nice waterfront sites as well, uh, Kearney Lake, non-electric sites, Whitefish Lake is a group camping site, Coon Lake, all non-electric, and last but not least Rock Lake, which is uh, on a very beautiful beach, but not a lot of privacy. Highway 60 is great to see wildlife, you are in bear country, there's a good chance you will encounter moose, here are some of the pictures over the last year. Hiking in Algonquin is amazing, there's 15 designated trails from easy boardwalks to lookout points to multi-day trips. Here's some footage from the Logging Museum Trail. It's from Spruce Bog Trail. It's a very nice easy boardwalk. Definitely recommend it. Another short trail that's not marked is Provoking Falls Trail, which starts at the Mew Lake Garbage. <laughs> Canis Bay is our favorite campground because the sites are big, you have privacy, there's a very nice beach, you can rent canoes here, uh, plus it's a great campground to see moose either at dusk or dawn. The beach over there is typically very packed, so what we do most of the time, we go here to the point where you have like a private beach, it's nice sandy, no weeds. Right here on top of the hill is the only spot where you can get water in the trailer. But uh, you do need to bring your own hose. Right on top here of the beach area. So bring a water hose. So about the Gonquin, we love a Gonquin. We typically go multiple times a year. There's great trails, great beaches, great swimming, great opportunities to see wildlife. Um, definitely would recommend it. One of the cons, uh, there is no town nearby. So if you need groceries, you need to drive for a little bit or, or gas. Uh, the other con is if you are trailer camping, there are only two fill stations and dump stations within Algonquin. One is by Mew Lake and Lake of Two Rivers. The other one is by Rock Lake. Either way, if you're camping at Canis Bay, it's quite a track to just fill or dump. There is one filling station at Canis Bay, as I just showed in the video. However, you need to bring your own hose. <laughs> 